We are all excited. We need something good to look forward to, of course, on this Veterans Day because uh, it's starting out just a little gloomy it is, with our weather, right? But it's nice to have a little bit of rain. Yeah, I mean, that's true. How many days? About 10, 11 days for lot, significant yeah. rainfall. So that also means been roadways. Be a little slick. Yeah, that you brought up a good water. point too about that cruise control for people that are commuting mm -hmm. in this morning. Just be extra careful, right? I mean, you know, cruise control is so convenient. Yeah, and when you use it all the time, <laughs> you're, it's like you're going back to driver's ed. Yeah, you're that's trying right. Trying to go 10 and 2. But yeah. yes, or now it's not 10 and 2. What has it been? Oh, gosh, did they change it? See, I, I don't know. I'm a 10 and 2 it. old school guy. Oh, no, yeah. I am right. Yeah. He, he knows everything. Here. <laughs> don't yeah, doubt right. yourself. <laughs> there we go, 10 and 2. But be careful out there because roadways are going to be slick to kick things off. Greg, he's got it going on. I tell you, he's always listening. Here's what's going on right now. Current temperature 69 degrees, and this is actually going to be the warmest temperature that we deal with all day long. It is going downhill. I always call this backwards day because you know the little ones are like, no, I'm good. We don't need a jacket. They're going to be happy that mama and daddy, grandma, Made sure they had it. Here's a live look for you over in Gallatin 67 and you can tell we've got that sheen out on the roadways. We're not seeing anything heavy for you guys right now, but it comes in these waves. Visibility also something to look out for. I was heading close to the Ag Center this morning in Franklin and it popped up in a snap. And if you're familiar with that area, quick little curb and there's a lot of wildlife. We've got several of those type issues all across Middle T Tennessee and Southern Kentucky. So just be mindful heading out because it does st really sneak up on you. Here's a look at where the cold front is. Now you'll notice going just off to our north. We are in those upper 20s. It's not going to get that cold, but it is going to cool us off, getting us closer to where we should be. Winds right now in the city are beginning to filter in out of our north, but we still have some southerly flow just off of the plateau. The heaviest fan currently moving its way just east of Nashville. Hendersonville, you probably heard some of that heavy rain just a few minutes ago, but you didn't hear any thunder because we don't have any thunderstorms associated. That's going to continue to move closer into Gallatin over the next few minutes. Also, you head into southern Kentucky, right around into Franklin. You're beginning to pick up on some of that rainfall for you guys. And then we head our way closer into Centertown. Dry right now, probably get a little gust of wind around 15 to 20 miles per hour, and then you'll notice some of those heavier showers taking place. Also, to ride into Fayetteville, seeing that really heavy band for you that's eventually going to move its way into Lynchburg, followed by Tullahoma over the next bit. This is not a severe system, which is some great news, but it ne necessarily come at the best time because a lot of people will be out and about. Temperatures right now, you got 50s off to our west, and then you head your way to the east where we are in those 60s. Numbers will drop throughout the day. We have already hit that high of 70 degrees. So as we go closer to around 3 o'clock, we'll be in those mid to upper 50s. 67, sunny tomorrow. We'll notice nice, clear conditions for our Friday. Saturday, very slim chance of showers. We could squeeze out a drop or two, but overall, your next best chance of rain doesn't take place until Sunday. And if you're wondering about Ada, well, that's going to stay well to our south. We've got a cold front that's steering it, and that's going to drop highs. Get this, Ben. Monday, 59. Tuesday, a high of 53 degrees. Ooh. All right.